Hello, Father Jovito once again here from the Diocese of Sacramento. Our warmest greetings to all of you, especially at this time to your homes, to your loved ones, and to all the people around the world. I'm talking about right now with my favorite saint of the week, and there is no other than Saint Teresa of Avila. A few years ago, I had a privilege to go to Avila in Spain, and I saw her relic, especially the left arm and also her heart. Who is Saint Teresa of Avila? She was born 1515 and she died October 15, 1582 and that's the reason why we celebrate her feast day today, October 15. Who, who is she? She was a Spanish noble woman and she was a Carmelite nun, a mystic, doctor of the church and she was the founder of the discalled Carmelites and the discalled Carmelites are working around the world especially helping the poor and educating people about the faith and she was named Teresa Sanchez de Cifida and her last words are fascinating why because it is a conversation with her to the Lord and those words are my lord it is time for me to move on well thy will be done it's just like the image of jesus in the garden of gethsemane when he said to the lord thy will be done and that's the attitude that we need to cling and to bring in our christian life thy will be done it is not our will but it's the lord's will she died early and her last words are fascinating to all Christians. And she was buried at the Convento de la Asuncion, the Alva de Tormes. St. Teresa regarded as one of the foremost writers of mental prayer. The prayer that I really like is the Nada de Torbe. And what's the meaning of nata de torbe? Nata de torbe means let nothing disturb you. Let nothing make you afraid. All things are passing in this world. Patience gains all things. If you have God, you will want for nothing. God alone suffices. She is known to be the patron saint of Spain to all the people who are sick, especially this time of pandemic. And she is the patron saint of mental prayer. So my brothers and sisters, we ask her intercession at this moment, especially this tough time of pandemic. We will ask that St. Teresa of Avila will give us her intercession to plead to our Heavenly Father to stop this pandemic. Saint, Ma Saint Teresa of Avila, pray for us. Thank you very much, and I will give you the blessing. May Almighty God bless you, the Father, the Son, and the Holy Spirit. Amen. God bless you all, and have a wonderful day. Bye.